Hey, what is going on guys? My name is Stevie and welcome back to some more Brutal Arc. So, as you can see behind me guys, the base is looking a little bit different. What I've actually done is exactly what I said I was going to do in the last episode. I completely took down the whole base, the old one, and rebuilt it, but moved it over to the right a little bit into the middle of this stream. Uh, the only issue I had, because I was going to rebuild this, but sort of live in the other little thatch one that we had over there, is we're only allowed to have one of these per tribe. This is our claim block. Uh, so I had to put everything on a horse and sort of place the foundation as center as I co uh, could and sort of build around it. So I had to lower a few foundations to get it to that point. Uh, so it's looking all right. It's looking all right. But this is the kind of design that I really wanted. And we're going to use this little space over here as like a mini dino pen. Uh, just for our creatures like our horse, dilos, and any other little creatures that we do get. You probably saw this little monkey on my shoulder. Carnage found a 300 Mesopithecus and he's told me to come and tame it. So we went and got it. Obviously, I've painted it all up. He looks absolutely incredible. He looks awesome. But anyway, we're not going to be focusing on the little blue monkey today. We're going to be rebuilding, well, not rebuilding. We're going to be uh, transferring this base into wood. Uh, like I said, the only reason I built it was nice and easy, and, and it's really easy just to sort of, you know, convert the materials over. So, like I said, this is the design I've got going on. Let's have a little, little look inside. Jesus, get a little bit excited there. Let's have a little look inside so you come in the main entrance you've got a little foyer area uh we've got some stairs going there we've got a little back door just going there which i think we might do a greenhouse out there eventually but you've got a little room on this side so we've got a little alcove here little alcove here i'm thinking of doing something along this edge because uh it's quite big and flat so we need to add a little bit of character to that uh just got the old roof this side, we've got another room, so we've got some uh, S plus uh, triangle foundations uh, underneath the uh, thatch ones, because I'm going to put a railing around the outside. So we've got like a little bay window type thing, another little alcove with our fret suppressor in, little alcove here, loads of little tiny little nooks and crannies in the base. And we've got some stairs, let's go up to the top, got a little platform, and then we're going to have our little bedroom up here so hopefully today is going to go pretty well we do need to replace the spiked walls and the dino gate but that shouldn't be too much of a problem so like i said earlier guys we've got a few things in here to sort of get the ball rolling with today so let's grab some of these out probably going to need a bit more wood for the ceilings and whatnot but we can definitely make a start with this so let's just go ahead and do most of it we should be good should be good to do most of it now I've left this like this for a reason uh, just in case I wanted to sort of move the claim block or anything like that but we can literally just go ahead put a foundation on top there we go <laughs> oh, it's because Nymeria just joined server lagged a little bit so we can literally just pick up this foundation and then uh, we got the claim block underneath, so that's absolutely perfect. So we'll place that back down. So let's just go ahead. Ah, you've got to be kidding. You have got to be kidding. Let's pick up that. Ah, oh, no, it's not going to place. So we're going to have to pick up this one first. Oh, I see. Ah, it's going to place the wrong way. Okay, so we're going to have to... Oh, for fuck's sake. <laughs> I'm actually in it. Jesus. Come on, just place down in the right place. You know you want to. There we go. That wasn't too hard, was it? All right, okay, so we got a couple of rooms to do. Let me lay out these wooden foundations, guys. And I'll bring you back, and we'll start working on the walls, I think. Okay, so the foundations should all be down. I don't... Think I've missed anything, so we should be good to go with some walls. So let's start putting them well, windows, walls, whatever. They're pretty much the same sort of thing. So let's put Yeah, that there. And can we get one in there as well? Oh, oh, we had it, we had it. 
There we go. Nice. Um, all right. I do need some regular walls. So maybe... Do we put... Let's put that there. That there. Put that there. We'll go do this side. So we'll put one here. We'll put one here. And I think we'll do the two center ones. And then the back two. That's pretty nice. Letting a little bit of light in. Alright, okay. So we go that one. And... Ah, oh, no. We don't want that one, do we? Alright, let's grab our demo gun out. Let's uh, take that out. And then we'll try and put... There we go. Okay, so that was a triangle up there. That's absolutely fine. Um, okay, what have I forgot? I think we pretty much... Ah, upstairs. Upstairs, of course. We put a window there. Window there. Yeah, fuck it. Why not? We can put... Uh, hmm, now, I've got to be careful up here because... They're going to be snapping on a different snap point. So, we might leave them ones for a little bit. Let's put... The window there. Got a few door frames as well. Let's put them in. It's facing the right way. Yeah, it's not joined up. So, that one... Is... I think it might be a little bit higher. Ah, there we go. That's better. That's got it. Um, all right, there's no more doors in here. Okay, so it's just this door and this door. Oh, really? <laughs> Let's pick that up. Let's pick that back up. Let's try and get this. Snapped on the right foundation. Right, it's snapping to that. So let's take that down. Let's see if we can get ah, here we go. No, you're not gonna you're not gonna wanna snap the other way for me, are you? Oh, there we had it, that way. Here we go. That's the way we want it. Okay, so we've got a few doors on. Looking good. Um probably could do with putting a few more windows in but we'll have to sort of uh, sort out this floor let's pick this floor all up just because we're going to need a little bit of scaffolding just to sort of uh, get these walls in the right place yeah because some of these are like not even level with each other like that one take these out all right, okay, so we're going to need some normal walls anyway. Let's take these out. That's going to be, in fact, let's go and grab... Uh, do I have any? I thought I made some. I wonder if I can. Uh, I'm going to need three of them. Let's go ahead and make them very, very quickly. Okay. All right, so these should go on here whether they will snap in the right place is another question okay that one did that one did okay there we go nice but we are gonna have to build some sort of uh, wall structure up we got a couple of walls anyway so let's put these down uh, so we want one there one ideally there build these up and we can put two walls up there okay so here could actually be oh that and that although now that's not oh, get here let's place you down properly 
So, you're going to snap there. Nah, snapping higher. Really, I think it might be something to do with the ceiling, possibly. Let's get rid of this wall here. I don't need that one there at the moment. Okay, there we go. We got it. So maybe we make this one the same. And then put that on top. Possibly. So we make it another window. Let's have a look. Like that. Make that another window. Yeah, I think that's pretty cool. I think that's pretty cool. Alright, nice. Okay, well I'm going to need some walls anyway. Because we don't actually have any. It's the only thing I haven't actually made. Um, what have we got factual walls there? Let's put them away. Okay, can we actually make any at all? I want to make like probably 15. We're going to need more than that anyway. We can make three. We're missing wood. <laughs> Alright, so I'm going to have to go out and get... A little bit more wood uh, in order to get the rest of this sort of built up. So I think I'm going to go and do that very, very quickly. Probably take out a trike. Might be a bit easier to get a little bit of wood on the old trike. Uh, yeah, I'm going to do this very, very quickly, guys. And I'll be right back. Alright then guys, so we got 25 walls, it might be alright, we might need a little bit more. Um, but we do need to put that up there. Oh, for God's sake. No, we do not need that there. We need it... Um, there, please. Ah, yeah, that'll do. That will do, and we should now be able to remove these. Beautiful. Okay, so we need to put on there. Oh, for God's sake, really? Really? Why did you do this? Let's take that out. Okay. Alright, let's see if we can. Uh... Right, yeah, because that's not snapped properly. Okay. Alright, so it's probably the problem with putting the roof on. Never going to snap in the right place. Okay, that has. Very nice. So let's get these ones in as well. Okay. And we'll do the same on this side. Okay, so we're going to have the same little problem. So we need to take these walls out. Okay, in fact, let's just take all these walls out. Because we don't... We're not really doing a lot. And at least then we can put the other walls in. Just like that. Alright, okay. So, I'm not too sure if we're going to generate any more threat than what we already had. I mean, our base was classed as wood anyway. Uh, so, I'm not 100% sure. Let's just uh, chuck that in there. So, I'm not... don't know if we can get away with... Uh, Having I oh am yeah. no, we're gonna need walls there, aren't we? Okay, so the only problem with that oh is going. Yeah, nothing's really changed with the fret suppressor over the last couple of days. Uh, we still got insufficient um, fret, so we can't use the early warning system just yet. But, yeah, nothing's really sort of happened. I've got no more perk points or anything like that. Um, so, we're all good. We're all good at the moment. Um, okay. So. Is that going to be alright? It might be. Might show a little bit on the outside. Uh, maybe. Uh, yeah. We'll have a little bit of different colour wood on the outside. But. You know, that'll be fine, unless... Nah, that's not going to work out, is it? <laughs> so right, I'm just trying to think. Just trying to think. Um, we need to get rid of them. Probably a good idea to take the whole roof down. Possibly. 
Oh well, I'll come down anyway, no problem. Alright, um Okay, so we're gonna need a triangle bit up there. We need a wall there. Alright, okay, let's carry on. So we'll put that one just there. We need triangle bits there and there. Okay, so we've got a wall here. Let's get that in. You fucker. Alright, okay, so we've got to change that back. In fact, did we have any more? I think we did. Maybe. Yeah, we got three. Okay, so we can replace some. Okay, there we go. That's got that. Okay, let's pick this up. No, I want to pick it up. Not switch it to stairs. <laughs> okay, so we've got five walls left. One, two, three. Okay, so we're gonna need to make some sort of. Uh, think, oh, see, that's not touching. Okay, so let's pick that up. That and that. Let's make a little bit of scaffolding down here. Which then should. Okay, right, we're out. Okay, so can we make any more? So it's pretty much like we are building this whole base again. <laughs> I've already done the sort of hard work, so yeah, let's just build it together. It'll be nice and easy. Nice and easy. Uh, where did the walls go? There they are. All right. Okay, so we need that one there. That one there. Alright, we're looking good on the inside here. Yeah, so we don't need these anymore. I don't want to pick my suppressor up. Hell no, I don't want to pick that up. Uh, yeah, I'm thinking like, if we put triangles sort of up there and there. Uh, actually, that could work. Uh, the only problem with the triangles is sometimes they don't like to uh, line up and it gets a little bit tedious. They're not really lining up very well. Oh, that, yeah, that did. Yeah, you see. But it doesn't matter because we can hide that with pillars. So that's not too bad, actually. Let's see if we can get this one in. Yeah, actually, that's pretty good. I wonder if we could do it on this side as well, then. Uh, which side was it? Oh, my, was it upstairs? Or was it downstairs? <laughs> uh, it might have been here, actually. Might have been here. Um, okay, right. So we need to take that off. Put that on. Uh, one there. Okay, and then was it one there? Or was it one? Mm. Can't actually. No, it was there, I think. Yeah. Yeah, it was there. Yeah. Okay, let's go up there. Ah, oh, you fucker. <laughs> I knew that was going to do that. We've managed to get it anyway. We managed to get it all good. Oh, for fuck's sake. Are you kidding me? Um, okay. Uh, yeah, so I don't think it's going to generate any more threat than what we already had. Because, uh, like I said, our base was classed as it was made out of wood anyway. So we should be all right. Oh, for fuck's sake. Stupid snap points. It's like clearly up there. Here we go. Okay, right. We should be good. We'll do the top in a little while. Okay, so we need to do this section here. Again. Be no, I picked up my threat suppressor. I didn't want to do that. Need to get that back down. 
Holy crap. Basically, you do not want to... The longer you don't have a threat suppressor down, the more threat you're going to generate. So we need to uh, get this guy back down pronto. Because like I said, yeah, we're going to generate a whole ton more threat every, uh, every minute it's down. So let's try and get this back in. We'll put it back there. Slap bang in the middle. All right, good. We got that back down. Woo! That was scary. Yeah, the longer you've got that um, like in your inventory and not placed, the more threat you're going to generate. So, yeah, that was lucky. That was lucky. All right, I'm going to need a couple more triangles. We're going to need whole roof system. Let's... Uh, Pick up this roof. Might as well. Let's get everything. So triangle, triangle. Triangle, triangle. Okay, right. Let's pick this ceiling up. Put wood one down. Let's grab that, that, that. I think that's all the thatch. We're looking good. We're looking all right. Okay, let me uh, get the rest of this stuff crafted up then, guys. And then we're almost finished with the build. It's coming along nicely. Coming along nicely. All right, so I'm just finishing off the ceiling. I had to sort of take a few things apart to level some of these walls up. A few of them weren't actually level, like these ones aren't actually level <laughs> so let's take them uh, actually yeah they are it's just because they're facing the uh, opposite way so I wonder if in fact let's uh, I need them to face the other way really so we put ceiling on up there let's go up here we should then be able to turn these around have them on the inside no um Okay, so oh, that's not going to work. So maybe they would just go. No, they're too high. All right, so the best it's going to get is these walls are going to be a fraction higher, but I could probably get away with that once the uh, thatch roof is on. I did change my mind, so we are going to stick with the fat roof um, just replacing some of these windows that should be windows rather than the door frames oh for fuck's sake <laughs> okay it's uh bollocks that needs to go why is that okay Ah, okay, yeah, because that is, is that a triangle? Slope wood wall left, yeah. Okay, so. Right. Let's take that back out. Let's take this out. Okay, right, so let's rebuild this back up. Because this is the problem. So then if we change that to that. Let's pull, I think, is it them ones? Yep. Yeah. Let's take these out. Shit. <laughs> oh no. It's alright. My fault. My bad. Should have put the ramp in as well. Okay. Let's build these back up. Uh, so we want a window. Then we want that on top. Okay. So let's put the ramp back in. Uh, which should connect perfectly there. 
Okay, like so. Right, that's all back in. All right. So now we should be okay. I don't want to take the fret suppressor down. Oh, there we go. Okay, now we should be able to place this. So ideally... Okay. So, do I need to take... Do I need to put... What do I need? Ah. I think I need that there. Then we should be able to place this. Let's go from this side. Probably be a lot easier, wouldn't it? Yeah. There we go. Alright, now we should be able to uh, remove this. Jesus, man. I didn't realise this was going to be this much of a pain in the ass. Alright, okay. So, we're going to need the little triangle pieces. Uh, I'm going to need one more can we just make it in our inventory gonna need that side so we should be good but yeah I'm gonna keep the thatch roof I think I don't want the whole thing uh, wood all right so it's gonna be a little bit if we start from that side that bit isn't gonna stick out as much so if we get the top roof in first so if we go like that. And if we start from this side. Yep, yeah, doesn't matter. We can put that one in. Okay, so if we go boom. And then that one as well. There's a little gap. But I can live with that little gap. <laughs> I can certainly live with that little gap. It's absolutely fine. It's not too bad. Yeah, it's manageable. It's manageable. Uh, right, so that's fine. So let's get the other ones in. Okay, so we've just got to do this bit now. So have we got any more? I've got five ceilings. So I did want to put the ceilings in here. So that should be, yeah, it's the same way. Very nice. Do that. Do that. Do that. Oh no, it's facing the wrong way. Okay, let's put that in the right way. Alright, so we need two more of the little triangle things. Let's go grab them. So we do need to put everything back in the base. Uh, everything's in my reward vault at the moment. Um, it's just there. It's just there. Floating around. It's all in here. We are going to have to move that at some point, though. No. Um, okay. So, we should be able to get this one in pretty much. Oh, we had it. Not there. Pick that up. Let's try and get this in right there. Alright, okay, yeah, that looks a hell of a lot better, actually. That looks so much better. Okay, so we've got a couple of thatch roofs left to go. Probably going to need a couple more, which is fine. Let's get that one in there. Yeah, so I'm not going to worry about this side too much uh, today. But I will have to sort of go ahead and change that at some point. Let's get one of them on. And then, ah, I got no grapples to get up there or anything. So can we put that on there? Okay. All right, looking good. So I'm going to need another one there. Oh, actually, actually, we might be all right. Can we hop on? Ah, uh, yes, we're on. Nice. Okay, and then another one just there so that should be everything 
Looking good. Yeah, looking good. Nice. Is that play the right height? Yeah, that'll do. That'll do. Very nice indeed. Let's have a look at the base. Looking good. Ah, no, we're missing two. All right, let's just get them last little two. Then we'll put the doors on. We should be pretty good to go, guys. Uh, literally just going to put in the last couple of items. Uh, what do we want? Thatch. We wanted two of them. Let's get them a go in. So there's one, two. And they go here. One. And... Are you going to slot in there for me? We had you. Two. There we go. Nice. So all we need is the pillars. Really. In fact, let's turn that into a wall. Oh, yeah. I forgot the railings. <laughs> and the doors. Uh, there's the doors. Uh, we got 12 walls. All right. Okay. So we should be all good. So let's go ahead. Put that that way no that's gonna face the other way isn't it we need to get it facing that way so really today is just sort of about prepping the base getting it all sort of strengthened out a little bit more as to uh what we really need in order to sort of survive okay so i'm thinking we're gonna use another it might be that one. It could be that one. But then again, I might be wrong. Yeah, it's going to be the other one. So what's that one? That is a right. So we're going to need a left. Which is that one. Let's get that. Um, right, left. Right, this one should be it then. Should. Yeah. Let's get that in. Beautiful. Alright, nice. Let's get a couple of railings up in here. Okay, so yeah, once we get sort of like pillars in, it's going to look a lot better. The only thing I don't like is the like steam of the water coming through. But I can't really help that, so that's fine. Let's get that in there, there, there. Oh, it's getting a little bit dark. Let's get this. Uh, let's get this uh, finished. All right, cool. Looking good. Looking good. I like it. I like it. And then maybe we should put. Hmm. Not like that, maybe. So we can pick that one up. We've got it. So we can place that back down. Yeah, and then we'll put one on this side. All right, let's see what we've got then, because we're going to have to start getting some stuff down, guys, like beds and uh, and all that. So we've got the upgrade station. We'll take that. Uh, Do we have a bed? We do have a bed. Nice. We've got the water. Okay, what else have we got? Blueprint station, let's grab that. Forge, we'll grab that out. Smithy, we'll grab that out too. And I think that might... Oh, yeah, we got these. Let's grab these out. In fact, can we make a table? Uh, probably help if I spoke table right. Yeah, there we go. What do we need? 12 metal... Okay, nice. Always like a wooden table with my mortar and pestles. Can't go wrong with a bit of a wooden table. So let's grab that down. Alright, okay. So where are we going to put... What room are we going to have what? Do I have this as sort of like... The, I think I want this as sort of like the kitchen area. I could probably put two preserving bins in there. A couple of fridges. Fridge either side of that possibly. And this side to be the sort of crafting area table would fit perfectly in here or even better still there yeah let's do that let's do that let's get this table in is that lined up pretty well I think it is 
Okay, let's get that table in. Nice. Okay, let's get the two mortar and pestle on there very, very quickly. Uh, so what we got, vanilla S plus. So put the vanilla one sort of here. About there. And put the S plus one on this side. And we can put something fancy in the middle. Not too sure as to what. Could probably put that in the middle actually. That's not a bad idea. Can we put that underneath? Hmm. Not really. Not really, but we could possibly put this on the outside. Eventually. <laughs> we could do it eventually. We'll put it just down here for now though. Just so we've got somewhere to sort of cook our meat up. Alright, okay. So, blue uh, upgrade station and blueprint station and the bed. We will put upstairs. Let's go upstairs. So I think we'll put the blueprint state upgrade station here. I think it will be a nice little fit for it. Let's put that about there. Alright, so we've got the blueprint station there. Augment station would go there. Which would be a nice snug little fit. It doesn't look too bad at all. Let's put our bed down, which is on our number three slot. So I think our bed will probably go here. That'd be not, uh, yeah, we could put our bed here. Put it this side. Then we could put our reward vault up there as well. Which we could probably make another one. Because I've got all my stuff in the one downstairs. Let's see if we can make another one of them. No, we need 13 more metal. Alright, that's fine. Um, what else did we have? We had a smithy and a forge. So yeah, I'm probably going to extend this bit out. Let's just grab this torch out. Yeah, probably going to extend this side out a little bit. Um, just so we're able to fit everything in. So we're not going to be able to fit a lot in. So I think the forge I'm going to put outside. And then we'll put the smithy... Do we want the smithy here? Yeah, I think we'll put the smithy here. And then we can put the fabricator in the little alcove. Which would be pretty perfect. When we get to that point. Um, okay. So is that a little bit further that way? A little bit more. Okay, that's pretty good. It's pretty good. So don't forget there's going to be pillars there as well. So let's try and get that probably about there. Should be alright that there so then the fabricator will go there which would be nice so yeah we open up this bit put a few more crafting stuff in there oh I think we did have uh, what was it was it the uh, advanced raft I think it was somewhere there it is we'll grab a couple of boxes as well so yeah we'll put the forge outside got the advanced raft so we'll put this I uh, can't really put it there. Can't really put it in there. We'll put it. Oh, where the hell are we going to put this? Should we put this upstairs for now? Let's put it there. Maybe. Here. And it's kind of in the way of the stairs, isn't it? We could put it here for now. We'll put it at, at the end of the bed. That's fine. Alright, okay. It's looking pretty tidy, pretty nice. I think I'm going to put some storage boxes along here eventually. Uh, threat suppressors this side. Have we got any more perk points yet? Nope. Uh, can we got... Uh, have we got... <gasps> we got sufficient threat. Nice. Let's activate that. So we've activated this, the early warning system, which means this will turn yellow. Uh, so it needs to scan again, but it will turn yellow if we're generating enough threat here on the server. And then, like I said, a couple of episodes ago, it will turn uh, orange. If we're in the top sort of three, I think it is. Uh, and then it will turn red when we have been picked. So we're getting our threat up there, guys. We are slowly but surely getting our threat all the way up there. So I'm going to wait for the night time to pass. We've done a fair bit of building today. Well, we've literally just been replacing, but it counts as building in my eyes. I think I'm going to try and put some uh, up there. Something up there as well. 
Just to try and hide that little bit off. Yeah, I'm going to sort that out, I think, while it's dark. And then I think to end today's video off, guys, we will probably put the uh, uh, spike walls back around the base and put in the dino gate just to sort of round it off, sort of upgrading our base to wood tier. Okay then guys, welcome back. So I have just placed the stone dinosaur gate. I tried to get it in line with these two foundations. And yeah, I've not done a too bad of a job. It's not too far away from our base, which is uh, pretty perfect. I've got 30 spiked walls. So we should be good to go around the sort of base and then hit the wall on that side. We should be all right. So what I've done, guys, during the night is I moved the torch over, placed the forge out front. Uh, I've added in this sloped thatch roof here because it will just sort of like square. So I thought I'd add a little bit of uh, character to it. So I put a thatch uh, slope roof in just there. What else did I do? <laughs> I can't actually remember. Oh, yeah, I put two preserving bins under the stairs. So that fits really really well and then don't forget we're going to have pillars either side so the gaps are going to be hidden i've added in the tap which is really nice we can now have water although we're surrounded by water so it doesn't really matter um i think that's pretty much it i haven't really done a lot upstairs added in a couple of railings here and there uh, oh yeah added in these little bits up here as well so it just kind of blocks them little sections off makes them look a little bit neater just put a rail in here to separate our bed from the upgrade station, which is kind of nice. I think that's about it, guys. Uh, we're not, not going to do the pillars today. I do need to do them at some point, though. And I do need to put some sort of ramp coming off the back down into the sort of underneath the waterfall area. Um, okay, so let's finish off with... Yeah, it's looking good. It's looking good. I'm really, really liking how it's turned out. Uh, so let's finish off by putting in these spiked walls then. So hopefully we have missed the tree. Hopefully. That tree right there. We should have. Yeah, yeah. That's fine. So we need to get it a little bit. Actually, that's not too bad. There we go. Anything? Not really. So we've got a little bit of room if we want to extend this little bit out, which I think... I will do at some point. Let's put the dino gate on. There we go. We've got a bit of protection now. So the dinos are all sort of safe over here. Dilos should be good there. Nothing's going to get over there, I don't think. He says. But yeah, I mean, it's looking pretty good, guys. It's looking pretty good indeed. We've got 20 spiked walls left. Not too sure what I want to do with them. Ah, look, and the turtle's already killing itself. Look, there's that stupid turtle from earlier. He's just going to kill himself. He's not hurting our spikes, that's our spikes hurting him. So, he can just carry on. <laughs> he can just carry on. Um, Yeah, I'm thinking maybe, just maybe, if we grab two of them don't know how it's going to look um, obviously don't forget we still need to put pillars in right so we're alright with that yeah he's going to kill himself so maybe if we did that actually that doesn't look too bad with the pillars in as well yeah, that's not too bad, actually. Are you... Jesus Christ. I'm going to have to get rid of him. What's doing me, Eddie? What level is he? He's only a 200. Come on, Trike. Let's do the deed. Let's get rid of him. 270. Nice. That's it. Now you're attacking me. Let's just corner you up. There we go. And even my monkey's on a mad one. Even a little monkey is on a mad one. He is not taking no shit. Let's just uh, get your keratin though. That'll do me lovely. And a bit of hide as well. Hide's always good. You haven't damaged these, have you? No. 
Nah, I see. He was just killing himself, really, but... Never mind. Never mind. Yeah, actually, that doesn't look too bad. I kind of like that. Kind of like that. Kind of separates that top little wood piece as well. And obviously, like I said, we'll put pillars down there. Yeah, I like that. We'll keep that as it is, I think. So there we go, guys. We have uh, upgraded our thatch base to wood. Finally. A uh, little bit easier to protect, I think. Uh, and obviously, with the spike walls on the outside and the dino gate. For the dinos that will spawn in at this tier, we should be alright. I think it's like raptors, wolves, kentros, just little things like that. Uh, we do run the risk of something coming from up there. If it does, we'll deal with it. Okay then, so to round off today's episode, guys, we do have two levels to put into our character. We're level 34, so we're going to be level 36. We do need to get to level 38, though. Because uh, once we get to level 38, we're able to learn the Pteranodon Saddle. Which will enable us to explore the world a little bit better than what we can at the moment. Uh, Sarko Saddle, Lymantria, and Kylo. Nice. Anki and Dodek. Definitely something I want to look at. Possibly Terror Birds as well. So we might do a bit of taming next episode. That's a Saber. Sabers wouldn't be too bad either. And a Pteranodon. Yeah, we could definitely have a look at doing a little bit of taming next episode, guys. But I think that is going to be everything from me today, guys. So, really hope you did enjoy today's video. It's just a little bit of a buildy one. Just upgrading our base, like I said. I've had a lot of fun, and I hope you guys have too. If you did, don't forget to leave a like down below, guys. It really does show support here on the channel. And if you're new and you haven't already, do not forget to subscribe. So guys, until next time, really hope you do go on to enjoy the rest of your day and I'll be sure to catch you all on my next video.